late at night, about midnight, which is just about right now. Gotta have my chocolate chip cookie dough ice cream. Good afternoon, everybody. It is Monday, November 16th. Um, the past couple days, my garage door here, when I go to close it, it's been going all the way down and then hitting the bottom and coming back up. So I just looked at it, and I got to figure out how to do this. Let me do this, and I can show you what it is here. As this goes down, that runs across the track, and when it gets to the end, it hits a little stop, a little trigger that's supposed to stop it. Right there. And as you can see, it goes right past it. The trigger is loose. Let me stop this here. I'll let it go off. Okay, that trigger, that trigger is wobbly. It's wobbling. So, this garage door opener is so old, I don't know if I can find another part. I mean, I'm sure I can, but I'm going to try to jump up there and see, uh, see if there's any way I can tighten it up, maybe put a screw in it or something. But that's my project for today. So later, guys. All right, guys, so I got this off. This thing ended up breaking, which I'm just going to try to glue back on. And then this slides over this like so. Oh, my, I can't do it now because it's broke. <laughs> and then when it comes up, it goes, hits that thing, which in turn actuates the switch to shut it off. So now I just got to figure out how to get that thing back together. And... I'm going to go online and see if I can order one. I'm not even sure what they're called. I don't see no part number or anything on it. So I'm going to have to do some research tonight. But anyway, in the meantime, I'm just going to open and close the door manually. So that's about it. See ya. All right, guys. So I did get this back together. Um, I just used uh, some epoxy in that. I did find, uh, I did find one online. It's... Uh, 11 bucks, so I ordered one, but I'm not going to be getting it until probably the end of the weekend. Today's Tuesday. They said I should get it maybe by like Friday or Monday, so it's probably sometime over the weekend. But in the meantime, I'm going to get that thing back together, see if it works right. Um, if not, I'll just keep doing the door manually. But I do want to show you my grass coming in. Starting to come in pretty good. Not really as good as I thought it was going to, but it is coming in. I mean, it's only been what two weeks, two and a half weeks, something like that. I'll know for sure how good that's actually going to be probably in another two weeks or so. So that's where we stand on that. So I'll keep you updated on everything, guys. It's bright out here. It's nice though. It's only like 74 degrees. Clear blue sky. Nice. Really, really nice. But anyway, that's what's going on right now. Later, guys. Good afternoon, guys. It is Wednesday, November 18th, 2020. I am going to do my third Corona haircut. Corona quarantining haircut. This is going to be the third time I'm doing it. So... I think I'm all set. I got my clippers here. I think I'm going to try something a little bit different this time since I'm still at home. So I'm going to try this and let's see what happens. There you go guys basically all I did this time I just did the sides I did a number two on the sides I left the top long so I'm sure I'll have to trim it up touch it up again the next couple days like I've always had to do but there's number three later guys all right guys so what I'm attempting to do I got some liquid epoxy there I got the little lever put back together and I got epoxy on there. Now what I'm going to do, I need to let that dry for a little bit, probably a day. I'll let it dry overnight and then 
That way those two pieces should be being held together. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix a bigger batch of the epoxy and I'm just going to coat the whole thing there where it broke. Just coat the whole thing, make a nice big thick layer on the thing and let that dry for a couple days and then put that thing back up and hope it works. Let you know. Later. Hey guys, so breaking it down. Breaking out the fire pit. So it's a little cool out today. I think it's only like 70 degrees right now. It's uh, cloudy, everything. The wind's blowing a little bit, but it is a little bit cool out. So I'm going to break out the fire pit. So later. November 18th, first fire of the season. <clears throat> That's it. I thought I'd tell you this, most of you might not know this, but I have been called Prince Charming on many occasions because for some reason, when I kiss strange sleeping women, they always wake up. Okay, guys, most of you have been getting to know me a little bit over the last uh, several months and everything. Uh, I think it's about time you meet my girlfriend. So, uh, are you ready, babe? Yeah. She's very camera shy. <laughs> All right, everybody, I would like you to meet my girlfriend, Roxy. Okay, babe, turn around. Hi everyone! Ah, oh, you look great. Ah, thank you. Say hi to YouTube. Hi YouTube. She's kind of shy. She don't like being on camera. Okay, stop now. Stop now. Okay, all right. I'll. I won't film you anymore. I promise. Okay, I promise. You can go back in the house now. Hi. Hi, right, guys. Well, there she was. Pretty nice looking, I think. I think she's kind of hot. But anyway, that's Roxy. Um, she might be in some future videos. Like I said, she's kind of camera shy and everything. So, uh, don't know how much you'll see her, but I'm sure she'll be in more. So, later, guys. Hello everybody. Well there you go. There's my last week. Um, you got to meet my girlfriend. Hope you liked her. I think she's beautiful. Gorgeous. Real fun to be with. Um, but anyway, um, not much really going on. I'm getting ready to get set up to uh, drive for DoorDash. Biggest problem I have right now is they just updated all of their apps, their regular app and their driver app. And you need iOS 13. Of course, the phone that I have, which is uh, the iPhone 6, is the one right under the one that will accept iOS 13. The i6 only goes up to 12.4. That's the highest that it takes. So I'm in the process of trying to find a new phone. Um, I've been looking at the 8s. They have refurbished ones online that I'm finding for a few hundred dollars. So... I'm still trying to figure all that out, but I'll get that sorted out in the next probably couple weeks or so because um, I'm going to want to start driving them because unemployment and all that is going to be ending here soon unless he extends it, but I don't know if he's going to or not. Um, that is what it is. But anyway, that's what's going on. Um, Thanksgiving coming up this next week. I got a 27-pound turkey, um, a 5-pound ham. I'm going to be having like 30 people over. Um, they're all going to be taking Ubers in so that uh, the cops can't see it and come in and shut me down for too many people. So, but anyway, that's where we stand. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good week. Later, guys.